Listen, we have wet weather across our area, including some showers and some rumbles of thunder that will still be possible this evening. Mixing in, though, there are some peaks of sunshine. So one of those evenings that may go back and forth from dry weather to wet weather, 62 degrees. It is a cool late May feel. Northerly winds at 14 miles per hour. That's somewhat influenced by the shower and storm threat that has just rolled through the Toledo Metro. We'll have those continued chances of wet weather this evening actually going to increase as we go after midnight tonight. Likely chances of rain showers and scattered thunder showers. That's going to keep us damp and cool to start our Wednesday back in the mid 50s. Here's how it looks on Doppler radar. Numerous areas of wet weather, including the Toledo Metro. Now the steadier rain shifting to the east of downtown from Oregon up to Point Place down toward Harborview along I 280 and take Woodville Road uh, out there toward uh, Genoa. That rain does pick up and become a little bit steadier. Thunder shower that's down there toward Waterville. A couple fresh lightning strikes now, did do a quick slice through this. It is not expected to be producing any severe weather, just some thunder lightning and a brief downpour that is just out there uh, headed toward Farnsworth Metro Park right on the Maumee River. Additional areas of rain, no severe weather going to be expected that will continue tonight as we get another piece of energy that dips into the area that will enhance our rainfall again tonight. Could end up with a half to uh, three quarters of an inch of rain just tonight alone. We have dropped back into the 60s. A few spots have yet to see the rain down toward Finley. You're in the low 70s. Tomorrow not going to be the day to get those mowers out. Additional rounds of rain going to be anticipated Thursday into Friday. That's when we're going to be looking good. We dry out, bright skies, sunshine, and gorgeous conditions will return. A little bit of a cooler feel, and the wet weather's kind of dampened some of the allergies. The pollen count has actually dropped. Both grass and tree pollen have trended down over the past couple of days. Rest of the night tonight, hour by hour forecast. Some on and off showers and storms between now and midnight. That chance is actually going to increase as we go after midnight and check it out tomorrow morning early 6 a.m. Rain and thunder going to be likely. It will be wet and cooler. Your Wednesday is going to start with very wet weather and it's going to linger much of the morning. Slow moving showers continue through late morning into the early afternoon. It may take us till late in the day before we really truly begin to dry out as we go toward dinner time Wednesday. Tonight, some isolated uh, showers could become more likely. Scattered showers and storms after midnight will be widespread. Upper 60s to near 60s. On your Wednesday, wet and cooler feeling weather, and then the sunshine returns Thursday into Friday, back into the mid 70s by Friday, close to 80 on Saturday, and then 80s will stretch through that first full week of 